Today, I wanted to challenge myself. So me and the boys decided to build a hemp farm inside of an iceberg. And this is what happened. So, how are we doing everyone? Today, I want to build inside an iceberg. Not just that, I also want to make a hemp farm, which is no ordinary feat, since I have no clue how to f to build a farm. But don't worry about that. First, we need to find a way to get inside an iceberg. And this is the plan I came up with. Our goal will be to get a boat under the iceberg, but it's not as easy as that, since the water pushes the boat upwards. We need to use a submarine to push it down and then get a person inside the boat to glitch through the iceberg. And if you're wondering, how is this possible? Well, I don't know either. <laughs> I was just a dumb kid who tried to put a square block inside the circle hole, you know? Kicks on the next. You need a bow? Yeah, I do need a bow. After getting a good start, we decided to go get some scrap from barrels, since this is a monthly server after all, and we can buy a bunch of loot from Outpost. Everything here is literally roleplay. It is, what the fuck is this shit? We were playing Reddit servers, so I'm not too surprised, but I'm telling you, this is the first time everyone on the server has a microphone. The outpost looks sick, you should see this. Outpost looks really cool. Dude, there's custom chairs that you can recycle in. Oh my god. Dude, this this is the best server. This is the best server. There's a, there's a chair you can sit in so people can push you out and just chill and recycle. <sighs> this is gonna be my new favorite server, dude. They want, I feel like there's no admin support here as well. As well. And I was not wrong, I spent an entire month inside the iceberg without getting banned. Well, I'll get banned now because of the video. Anyway, remember this roleplay village? Well, it's great because it has a tier 2 in it, and it's like a secondary part of an outpost. We were ready to leave, we had everything crafted, but then I saw something behind us. I'm gonna loot, I'm gonna loot, I'm gonna loot. I didn't want my teammate to die from outpost, so I rushed over to loot it myself. We should go back. We should go back. We recycled all of these components and bought a bunch of stuff. With this new supplies, we headed our way to Dome, where we wanted to build our base, since it had a lot of resources. I think I dropped meds. Hop in. After finishing the base, we went to gather scrap so we can buy a boat and a submarine. Yeah, I'm low grade. Alright, perfect. Now all the boring stuff is behind us, and now we have to get inside the iceberg. First action is we're gonna buy a submarine and a boat and make our way to the iceberg. So, when I was recording this, I was thinking that this would be a smart idea to hide the submarine under the iceberg. But little did I know that the submarine's oxygen will drain out even if you're not inside of it. And this is what happened. Okay. Uh, there's like 20 in it. I think, uh, you should give me some. A little, a little, a little, put a little something in the front. Okay, thank you. Wait, what? Wait, what? Might have a problem. What's the problem? I can't get the sub. No, because it uh, went up and now it's stuck by the iceberg. See, what he was trying to say is, even if you're not inside it, the submarine loses oxygen. And if it's out of oxygen, it automatically goes up to get more air. But since it's under an iceberg, it doesn't get more air, meaning you can't even enter it anymore. Hey, at least we got scrap here. I, I, I might have messed up a little bit. Anyway, we went to buy a new submarine, and there was a long awkward silence between oh, us. So this is why I'm arguing with you, because you do a lot of stupid shit without digging them. You lose a shit ton of time. Who? Not by doing one, by doing multiple things, you know? Well, yeah. But you, you, like, you, got, you gotta understand. Make mistakes sometimes. Yes, I know. But, you know, not that constantly. I, like, nah. okay. I, like, really, I understand nah. mistakes. I do mistakes too, but sometimes you need to think a bit more. <clears throat> um, I need 50 more scrap. 
You know we do a little bit of trolling. After getting our submarine, we made our way back home and started working on our ramp. The ramp is needed to get the submarine on top of the boat and for the glitch to work. As you saw in the picture, stage 1 is pretty basic, it's just a foundation. In stage 2, we built the honeycomb to support the upper layers, meaning it's, it was just a support system for the ramp. In stage 3, we had to finish the ramp and make it functionable. We had to build stage 3 at night because it was taking us so long to build it. But luckily something we did find out is that the submarine has some crazy light power. It shows so much light and makes the building really easy. And the last thing I now have to do is get the submarine up the ramp and push it on top of the boat. So this was my first attempt at it and it was not going good since well, I was clearly too high up. I didn't realize this at the time, but not to worry, after another 2 minutes of fidgeting my keyboard, I finally made it. Now all I have to do was to line it up perfectly with the edge of the twig and then I could push it on top of the boat. And this was such a, like, a hit or miss thing because you never knew when you are actually going to get it. It was all about luck. So, let's see how it goes. Uh, I think we should be fine. Nope. Bro, this shit brings back memories. It is so annoying. It's just like the car thing we did to get inside the rock. What I mean by that is to get the glitch to work, it's really hard. It takes a lot of luck and a lot of time. Ooh, look at that shit, bro. Look at that shit. Jeez. Oh, that was... Oh, was perfect. And the second attempt also failed. So after that, I made the build even better by adding half walls. This allowed me to push the submarine from closer and made it easier to get up the ramp. And after another two failed attempts, my teammate thought of using another submarine to push it in and under the first submarine. There was something new that I didn't really think about at first. Okay, I'm going to get the other one. And then we got the second submarine. This is what it looked like. It was pretty weird. We were trying to get the first submarine out of the way and push the second submarine above it so the boat would fall under the second submarine. Go, forward, 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 more, 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 more. This is our first time doing the submarine method, and holy shit, we got lucky. We got it right away. Oh, okay, don't touch it, don't touch it, don't touch it, don't touch it. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. We finally did it. We got the submarine above the boat, and it took us forever, but it worked. All I had to do was to readjust the boat under it to make sure it wouldn't slip off the sides, so I pushed it a little bit. Bro, this shit looking janky, man. What if it, what if it gets out the way? Dude, what if? That's stuck. Oh, I, I heard steps above us. I hear it as well. I hear steps above us. Oh, this is, uh, this is unfortunate timing. We have the sub in the right place. <laughs> Got everything ready. But, um... He hopped in the submarine. No! No, don't drive that! No, don't drive that! Dog, oh, come my, on, my man! God, fucking God. These amateurs, dudes. We just got it as well. Fuck, you should've been in there. But well, that's not your fault, but fuck, man. And just like that, the submarine got taken from me. Under my nose, of all things. But it's alright. At this point, I was good enough to get back into it. But I was so mad. You just, you just listen. He's just having a joy ride in that shit right now. These fucking amateurs, bro. Come on, dude. Why the fuck weren't we in those subs? That was my fault not going in that one either. God damn it, dude. We just caught it as well. Anyway, I went AFK for 30 minutes, and when I came back, they were gone. And also, my submarine was out of oxygen. Something that I found out later that has nothing to do with the story is that these guys had a submarine base. Uh, out of all the things, they had a submarine base. Uh, I am the guy. Uh, we are the guys with the submarine. That he kind of took earlier. Oh, I got it. And all there was left now was to drive to the iceberg, but slowly. Alright, if you're wondering why I'm not going at full speed backwards, it's because I, I don't want the boat to slip. 
Bro, it, it has happened once before and it was so scary. If that happens, that's like another hour of time just wasted. Because it's so hard to get the boat under the submarine. Anyway, so we went at a slow pace and every now and then I rechecked on the boat if it's still there. And eventually we oh, made it our way to the iceberg. And as you can see the shadows on top of the submarine. Pretty scary looking. They're really fucking close. Can you come here actually? With like, I don't know, five Logan would even do, bro. Actually, no, we, we should be, we should have actually enough. We might have enough. Just have our head over. While my teammate Fast was uh, swimming over, I started building the foundation of the entire base. I made it out of stone and added half walls, but people couldn't soft side it. And then I just used wall frames to make it up, so it's non soft sideable, you know? Me, uh, I think I got four. I think that should be enough. Pretty close. Gotta get a bit lucky, but we should have enough. You know, I like the word bit lucky. It might be my new slogan. Oh. Ah, uh, I need the wetsuit. Alright, I'll get it for you. Oh, I need the wetsuit as soon as possible. Oh, what Actually. the fuck? What the fuck? Fast! No. Fast! What are you doing? That's what are you doing? Hey, if you don't understand what's happening, this guy is in deep cold water where you die in like approximately 30 seconds if you're just chilling here. And this is the same guy who said... Like, really, I understand mistakes. I do mistakes too, but sometimes you need to think a bit more, honestly. All we had to do at this point was to drive the submarine away from the iceberg and get him inside the boat. Oh, actually, we don't need the logger, I think. Yeah, so let me give you a quick update on what's happening. I have two fuel inside the submarine. Uh, there's just a little bit of uh, oxygen. And I'm on 30 HP with no bags. And just to top it off, uh, my teammate died to the cold. But he luckily has a bag, so he'll be back soon. Uh, we'll have time. We'll, have, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Whoa. We're under here. We got two low grade, and I got 48 seconds on my tank, so you should come quick. Yeah. Oh no! I got one question. If I break the car. The car? If we need that low grade, I'm gonna fucking murder you. You might, no promises. Oh come on man, I would I could have just Just shut up. Just shut the fuck up. Just shut the fuck up. Okay. Gonna close quick. Alright. Uh Alright, I got 20 HP. Hopefully I make it. Can you go check where the boat is so I can go there right away so I don't die? Because I got 19 HP and uh pick up the bag. Do you pick it up? Do you pick up the bag? About to come. I got only 15 HP. We gotta do it quick, by the way. Ready? Yeah. Oh, dude, it's so cold. I'm going. I'm gonna be so wet. I'm gonna get inside the boat. Get inside the boat. We don't have time. Eleven HP. Did you go to the wrong place? I don't know. I'm stuck, I can't move. I'm dead. Jump, 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 jump! Let's go up, go up, go up, go up, go up! Go, up. Uh, go middle, go middle, go middle, go middle, go middle. Look for the building, yeah, go to front, look for the building, look for the building. Start building up. Oh my god, start building up from there. Yeah, you can get it. Oh shit, get shit, get out of the roof, get out of the roof. The water just went high. Yeah, 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 it does that <laughs> sometimes. Good shit. You get a crash jump. Put it in the corner or some shit. It wasn't close at all, no. Mm -mm. What did it take this like three hours? That's nothing. Come on. What, you just ran out of low grade and you didn't know? Yeah, I ran out of low grade and I, got, and I thought I was out as well. You should have seen my POE. Mine was so fucked. 
All right, quick recap. All of the easy work is out of the way. Now we have to do the PVPers worst dream, and that's building a farm. Never done it, and uh, I'm scared because because back in the day you could just you know throw a few water bottles on the hemp and you get like a hundred out of it. Now there's like uh, entire farm system bullshit that I don't know. Eh? So uh. Okay, jackpot. Here we go, guys. Everyone I get found excited. this. The body, so I didn't check more. But um. Oh, you're you're hyped, bro. Oh. 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 oh, 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 oh. <laughs> um. Um, there you go. Look, you've got a build. Okay, you've okay, got okay. Fine, fine, fine. That 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 base DK wasn't that rare. The difference between these two clips is like three weeks. I was on a monthly server. To keep in mind, we need a lot of stone for the base since it was underwater and we had to build these huge pillars. So we went to excavator and came back. Excavator came back. Excavator and no, never mind. We just just started building the farm. All right. Now the hardest part is getting the perfect hemp seed. To get the perfect hemp seed, you have to get perfect genetics, DNA, whatever you like to call it. And you have to mix and match them for an hours on end to get just the right seed. So what we had left to do was to collect around 100 seeds and start mixing. And that is exact- nah, <laughs> no fucking way I was gonna do that. I uh, just blew up some kids a bit. <laughs> Holy shit, you hit the jackpot. Yeah, I was gonna eat those words. Uh, <laughs> there was literally nothing in this. Uh, not a single thing. There's just a bunch of seeds. Not a bunch of seeds, a bunch of berries. Uh, that's about it. I went free C4 for some weird reason. But it's definitely a head farm. Anyway, we found a new base and started hitting that because, well, we didn't get the seed that we needed. <laughs> you scared, huh? Nah, I'm fine. I'm chilling. I love it. Thank you. Hey. Where should we hit? Okay, we uh, <laughs> Make sure it's the. Uh, I can't tell. I wanna hit yeah, this. Yeah, it's fine. It's, it's fine. It's fine. If, if something we drill down, one more floor. I swear to God. Oh wow, pumpkin clothes. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> pumpkin clothes, baby. Bye. Uh, Straight down? Uh, this or this? I choose this. Right. I don't know why. It's you know. the table. I don't know. Oh. It's, oh, it's oh, <laughs> Mini's gone. <laughs> Mini's Wait, gone. Mini? Yeah. Oh no. Oh my god, dude. No, you hit the worst spot possible. <laughs> this is pretty sad. This is actually really sad. This is not even funny, man. You got on? Yeah, no, no, no. Let's hit the right one. I feel like this can is my we, turn. Can we still get up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, come here. How? Come here. Dude, calm down. You can jump from the edge. Oh, come yeah. here. I just told you before you even started screaming at me. Yeah, come here, shoot the... What? I wanna hit that. I feel like it's gonna be a honeycomb. You shoot it, it's not enough to break it. Please. Yes! Yes! Finally! Yes! I told you! All me! All me! Yeah, All me! Him? Yeah, yeah, yeah! We got the hemp! We got the hemp! Came here, Clipper. Oh no, I don't need it. Nah, that's, I'm not even better. I was trying to use you, you know? <laughs> <laughs> So we made our way back, put our stuff in the boxes, brought the loot inside, and then we planted our seeds. I just wanted to see how good the farm is without having electricity set up. And turns out it was god awful. All, all my crops were dead the next morning. Anyway, set up the electricity part. So we need water, uh, light, and heat. 
So I couldn't put the water pump next to the iceberg and then I decided to do these little foundation thingies in the water that transport water from one place to another. And after spending six hours for that thing, okay not six, like three, okay, uh, it didn't work. So fuck it, I just bought water canisters, the good old way. And this is the final result. Let's go baby, I spent an entire week of my life getting a shitty farm that gives me 5 hemp per slot. Let's go. <laughs> now all jokes aside, this was a fun experience and it was definitely out of my comfort zone. So, I recommend doing the same sometimes, you know? Play the roleplay of life. Also, if you want to see me take down Heli inside of an iceberg, then check out my second channel. I'll be uploading there. So, see ya boys.